What's up, Hardwood fans? I'm your online host, Taylor Nimmo, and I'm here with reporter Anna Hoffman as she was out at Meg's tonight as Eastern had a tough loss, 57 to 55 against South Gallia. Now it came down to the final minutes tonight. How um, was South Gallia able to pull away? Taylor, this was one exciting game. Eastern was leading the whole time. They're up by seven at the end of the first half and they continued to keep their lead into the third quarter. It wasn't until there were seven minutes left in the fourth quarter where they had 11 turnovers. South Gallia just took charge right from there. It was insane. It, it was a buzzer shot. They made the two points right there. It was back to back to back. They were running and the crowd was going wild. But this just, Eastern must have just lost their fire. South Gallia gained theirs. Yeah, so obviously at the very end there, what did South Gallia do to be able to pull ahead? How were they able to get that energy and momentum going for them? It was just like a flip of a switch. Your senior players knew this could be their last game and they, their momentum started going and they were running. They were not gonna stop. They got all their rebounds and they were scoring. They would steal the ball from Eastern explains the 11 turnovers, but it was just so great to see them do that. As much as we love our Eastern Eagles, it was South Gallia sure did have some fire. All right, well, it sounded like it was an exciting game. Well, unfortunately, it is the end of the road for Eastern tonight. The action does not stop here, so make sure you like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and add us on Snapchat at Hardwood Heroes for all of your updates. And don't forget to tune into this week's episode of Hardwood Heroes on Sunday night at 11 and again on Monday night at 6. But from Anna Hoffman, I'm Taylor Nimmo reminding you to be heroic.